Uh, now let's see this problem. How many points on or inside the circle x square plus y square minus 2x y minus 2x minus 2y minus 23 is equal to 0 have integral coordinates. First of all what uh, we do? We just convert this uh, into a normal circle equation. So that is in center radius format. So x square minus 2x plus 1 plus y square minus 2y plus 1. Now since we ha have added uh, two ones, so we need to deduct them also. So instead of minus 23, now it will be minus 25 and that's equal to 0. So this is x minus 1 whole square plus y minus 1 whole square is equal to 25. Now the, the center of the circle is at 0, 0, right? Uh, sorry, I'm sorry, 1, 1. So what if we can do is uh, to make the calculation simple uh, since we just uh, wish to see the area of the circle right we we are not interested ec uh, on uh, in actual location of the circle so what i can do i can shift the origin so we can rewrite the equation x square plus y square is equal to 5 square right now this is the equation of the circle right now two three types of questions can be framed uh, based on integral coordinates uh, how many points are inside the circle on the circle and uh, inside and on the circle right in this particular question on or inside the circle sometimes you may be asked only inside the circle right so we just go step by step now see we know the pythagorean triplet 3 square uh, 3 4 and 5 so 3 square plus 4 square is equal to 5 square so first of all what we can do is x square plus y square less than equal to 5 square we try to satisfy this equation okay for first quadrant only right whatever calculation we do for first quadrant the same calculation will be uh, we, we can make this particular calculation four times to calculate for the entire circle right so first of all what I do is I just calculate x square plus y square less than equal to 5 square but I will not be taking any of the coordinate as 0 to avoid the confusion see what happens if we take 0 as coordinate suppose uh, 4 0 will be a point that is integral point that satisfies this equation but 4 0 will be somewhere here right now what happens if you calculate that and uh, multiply this entire calculation by 4 uh, it will give you the wrong answer because this point is is on this axis and uh, this axis is common between these two okay so avoid zeros in first go just calculate the other points zeros we will calculate separately okay so x square plus y square less than equal to 5 square so 3 4 we just have to choose the coordinate uh, one of them uh, or both of them should be less than 3 and 4 okay so we can start with 1 1 so it's 1 1 1 2 1 3 1 4 no 1 5 will be there okay now this these three coordinates can be written as 2 1 3 1 and 4 1 when uh, y x coordinate is greater okay so in all uh, 3 into 2 6 plus 1 7 points we will be getting over here similarly we can start with 2 2 so it's 2 2 2 3 and 2 4 so 3 2 and 4 2 so further 2 uh, into 2 4 plus 1 5 then we have 3 3 and 3 4 3 4 will uh, will be the point that will be on the circle right if you just wish to see inside the circle then you have to skip it so 3 3 3 4 so 3 4 can be written as 4 3 also when x coordinate is greater so 2 plus 1 3 so 7 plus 5 12 and these uh, 3 15 points they will be uh, either on this line okay this part of the circle on this area right so now if we multiply this by 4 we will be getting all the 4 parts so that is 60 okay now since we have skipped zeros so I start with 0 1 0 2 0 3 0 4 0 5 so 5 point on this line 5 this 5 this and 5 this so 20 more points then still we have 0 0 that is origin so one more point so in all there are 81 points which are on or inside the circle having integral coordinates okay so once you are clear the uh, clear with the concept the problem will not take more than a minute uh, to solve 
I hope it's clear to you.